First of all, you need to go to the setting. And then you want to go to general. And then go down to security. And under security, you want to make sure you check the unknown source. Allow installation of app from source other than the Play Store. You click on that and press OK. And now you gotta go to your uh, internet or your Google Chrome uh, browser or any other browser that you are using or currently using, whatever that you wish to use. So for example, let's go to uh, use Chrome. So right here, you gotta be careful. You gotta make sure you type in uh, APK Mirror, M I R R O R dot com, APK Mirror dot com, and then you click on Go. And once you get over here, you want to click on the magnifying glass over here to search. And you search on uh, Google Play Store, Google. It's Google Play Store right there. You just click on it and click on go and search. And here comes all the new and latest version. As you can see right here, it says uh, January uh, 9th, 2017, version 7.409, whatever. So as you can see from the top to the bottom, the top is the most uh, latest uh, version. And as you can see, you keep on scrolling down. Those are the orders uh, version down there, okay? If you don't know, uh, you could also click on the I which is give you the informations and then it give you all the details over here the download it was uh, 51,735 times already and that's the file size so you want to go ahead and do this when you accidentally uh, delete your Google Play Store or if your Android phone did not come with the, for example, if you purchase like a Huawei on the previous version or maybe ZTE or a Zeus that is, that are already unlocked and somehow it did not come with the Google Play Store, this is what you need to do. And unless you, uh, rooted your uh, device, and you lost everything and everything back to factory setting and somehow it didn't come with the Google Play Store, this is what you want to do. And then you go ahead and click on the download uh, button right here. So this is uh, just an ad, you want to go ahead and close it. And you got to scroll down, okay? You can see uh, what is uh, available. APK right here. So as you can see, it show you a Google Play Store, uh, the latest uh, version right here. And as you can see, you just click on the variant right here for the file's name that matches the description up there. And this is uh, for Android 4.0 and up. You click on that file name. 
and make sure you scroll down until you see uh, download. So this is the full description about the files, the version, and how many people downloaded already. And minimum has to be 4.0 ice cream sandwich and higher up to uh, Android 7.1, which is the latest uh, NuGet. And that's a DPI. 240, 320, or 480 DPI. So make sure you just click on download APK over here. Don't worry about this install. This is for the Amazon. So it's, there's a lot of advertising over, over here. So make sure you click on the right one. There are a lot of viewers saying you know, they cannot find a download. And this is the way that I'm going to show it to you. This is how you're supposed to download the APK files over here. So after you click on download, you should have a... Your download is starting. And thank you for downloading the Google Play Store. So you can click on whatever uh, you want to use with. I have a uh, Chrome or Dolphin or Internet as my... Uh, browser or internet browser you just click on any one you want so i'm going to go ahead and click on the google chrome and just hit just once so i said the file may may harm to you or whatever so just ignore it and then press ok there's no virus this is it's a trust at worthy site and as you can see it is uh, downloading right now So it says download complete. You can click on it. And then uh, over here, you want to use a uh, package uh, installer and just click on just once. Do you want to install an update to this uh, built-in application? Your existing data will be will not be lost. The updated application will get access to 